Waheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Waheguru Ji Ki Fateh. On behalf of our founder, Sant Baba Amar Singh Ji, and on behalf of every member of staff, I would like to invite you to our Year 7 Open Day, which is going to be held at the grounds of Guru Nanak Sikh Academy between 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. on Tuesday, 5th of October. This is a great event for those parents who are looking to find a school for the admission of their children uh, for next year in year seven for 2022. We invite you at Guru Nanak Sikh Academy because we believe that at this school you have every opportunity that you want to provide for your child to become a complete citizen. We want every parent who's looking for admissions next year to come and have a look at our facilities, our provisions, come and meet with our staff and see what we have to offer. We believe that our share values help our children to grow academically, socially, spiritually and economically. They understand the world better. They contribute in every aspect of life. They have these opportunities because we provide them with the foundation of good education in every subject. We start off with seva. We move on to humility. We focus on achievement in every aspect of life. And we do this while we focus on respect and equality. Our share values are something which every student practice in every part of their life. In the previous series, you probably have seen a graduation event that took place last week. It was a great opportunity to welcome back our cohort from last year who, who gained that academic excellence and achieved A stars. And now they're on to their journey into universities and, and further education. We are proud of these students. Our outstanding results have been putting us in leading schools throughout country. In 2019, Guru Nanak Sikh Academy was number one in Hillington for their results. And we are proud that our staff works day in, day out to support every child, to make their education personalized and ensure that every single student is given the opportunity so they can find the destination which creates a good citizen out of them. I hope you will take this opportunity. You will come and attend our open day next Tuesday on 5th of October between 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. with your children and you would be able to see what we have to offer. This is an opportunity for your children to come and decide a very important decision of their future, for their future. And I hope that you will support our school and you will support your children in making that very important decision. With that message, now I'm going to pass on to team of our senior leaders who will be coming in and talking to you about different aspects of our, our schooling, our education, our provisions that we offer for your children. Waheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Waheguru Ji Ki Fateh. Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh. Welcome parents and especially welcome our future children. I am Antonio D'Onofrio, the Vice Principal of Guru Nanak Sikh Academy. And we're absolutely blessed to be here to be able to offer you the opportunity to come and find out more about our offer and the broad and balanced curriculum and the future opportunities we hope to serve you, our children. We are here and hopefully you have no fear or trepidation that may stop you on your way because we believe by coming here we'll give you something extra to say. Those virtues and values that are there you might think are hidden inside. Not at all. Let's pull them out and let's let your future glide. Let's take you on that journey. So come on open evening and beyond to ask so that in your future achievements and your virtues for all you may bask. That you may come to serve humanity and do so much more. And let's start on that journey by welcoming you through our door. Let's take you through the classroom, 
through to every teacher and student who's been there so you can see there's a future bright and for you beyond compare something that you will come to deliver and deliver you shall because you will bring it so much glory within to the futures of those without those who we come to serve and those who we come to honour and those that we bring so much glory without dishonour and those whom we serve by simply knowing we have a duty beyond compare. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, our young ladies and gentlemen, it is you and you will be there. So we welcome you again. Come start your journey here. Come fear without fear and know that in your heart you have a massive place and a plate to part. A part that was there, truly written and to be written for you. Let us come and help you on your journey so you will have more than a clue. Let us help you in your next steps. And like I said, with the joy and the smile in your heart, that you will be absolutely true to yourself and others apart. And you will gain from every classroom, every teacher, through every door. You will walk with that knowledge around every corridor and every floor and every person and student and fellow brother and sister that you meet. You will be ready with that purity of heart to greet, to know that we are here to learn, to bring, and to aspire to who we are to become, so that when we achieve, and we've had that educational fun, we are also offering the best of who we are to be to every brother, every sister, and every member of every community. Let us help you on your journey, and we welcome you both to Open Evening or on one of our set tours during the term. Please contact the school for further information. Speak to Mrs. Here and our wider team who oversee Year 7 and support the transition into secondary. Vahigurji ka khalsa, vahigurji ki fateh. Good afternoon, my name is Mr. Perriman and I oversee the pastoral support at Guru Nanak Sikh Academy. We are a unique school where the share values underpin everything we do at the school. We have a highly trained and outstanding pastoral team who look after the children and work tirelessly for them to succeed throughout the school. We have created a safe and secure environment where students feel safe and relaxed and able to fulfil their full potential. With this come outstanding results year upon year. Student safety and wellbeing are at the core of everything we do at this school. We have a number of different platforms and protocol ensure that students and staff are able to report any concerns or worries that they have. We welcome you to Guru Nanak Sikh Academy. Waiguru Jika Kalsa, Waiguru Jiki Fateh. My name is Akam Jokko Chahal and I'm a current student studying in this impeccable school. First of all, I would not be who I am today without GNSA. The overall community and staff of this school are remarkable and has guided all the students of the school, including me, through these past two difficult years. This school offers magic in the form of experiments in laboratories, sports in the sports hall, creativity in the theatre, discussions in the Gurmuth classroom and many more. Not only, do, does this, not only do all these things already make our school special, but something I personally love about GNSA is that we can express our culture freely and possibly learn our mother tongue. Um, I look forward to seeing you in, the, in our open evening, parents and students. Greetings fellow students, educators and parents. On this very day, I stand here to discuss discuss the magnificent transition that I and many other individuals have made from year six, the last year of primary school, and to year seven, secondary school. Before I start, I would like to clarify the order in which I will elaborate the specific speech. First, the journey, in w the journey through the final year of primary school, year six, will come first. Then, the overall transition between those two fantastic years will come next. Finally, I will explain my first impressions of secondary school. So not to beat around the bush, let me begin. Firstly, in year six, I endured many arduous adventures. Although those tedious treks were the exact same ones that made me, and I believe many other students will agree, confident of the future that awaits me. With this courage, I have been now brought to the very spot I am now, sitting amongst this marvellous school. Furthermore, somehow, Year 6 completely extinguished my anxiety towards secondary school with its amiable staff and encouraging words. 
segueing into my next top subject, the transition between these two years went as well as as you might say it flawlessly. The reason being was there was major prep preparation even um even a month or two before the time period of the transition, if my memory serves me right. In addition, we had various taste taste lessons which introduced the delight of secondary school. Thirdly, so far as my first impression of secondary school is extremely pro- positive due to numerous fact- factors such as discipline that prevents us from committing deeds that go against our regula- regulations while com- maintaining our happiness. Additionally, their diverse lesson plans create new subjects that I want to pursue in the future. Moreover, the educators are amazing at their duties, providing enter- entertaining lesson plans and interactive lessons. In conclusion, throughout my journeys in this school we call Guru Nanak Sikh Academy, nothing but po- positive out- outcomes approached me. And besides that, all I can say is thank you, Guru Nanak Sikh Academy. Thank you for your time. Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh. My name is Mrs. Heer and I am the progress leader for Year 7 here at Guru Nanak Sikh Academy. I have with me today Mr. Dillon. Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh. Um, thank you, I'm Mr. Dillon. I'm pastoral manager and one of the designa- designated safeguarding officers at GNSA. We are looking forward to welcoming you to our school on the 5th of October for the open evening for current Year 6s coming into Year 7 in the next academic year. It's been a difficult time for many of the students not knowing whether or not they're going to be able to see secondary schools, visit them and get a feel for real secondary life. The vast array of subjects that are offered here are second to none. We are lucky enough to have the updated technology, drama studios, labs for science and sports equipment. One of the questions often asked to me as a progress leader is why, why this school? Why no other school? And I think, Mr Dillon, um, some of the things that we can say as both parents of children who come to this school but also as staff at this academy is that the service that is given to your children is second to none. You won't be able to beat Gurnanak Sikh Academy. That's my opinion. Mr. Dillon, why would you? Why would anyone want to send their student or their child to Gunanak Sikh Academy? Um, I think it's um, important to to remember, especially in in my role, um, that uh, one of the key aspects of my role is to ensure the the safety and well being of our students. Um, as you as you mentioned, Mrs. Heed, I mean, you know, I, I my children have sort of gone through primary uh, and well into secondary as well. Uh, my son graduated last year. Um, and my daughter is currently uh, in year 13. Um, and I've always found, um, being a, a parent and obviously a member of staff, that the environment that GNSA has created um, has been a very nourishing one um, for students to, to, to build upon their existing knowledge um, and obviously to go out um, when they do leave this school um, to go on to do great things. Um, the environment that we create, the curriculum that we have is broad, um, it's robust um, and from, from my role in particular, um, from a safeguarding role, um, I think we've created an environment where students can come in and flourish and feel safe um, and know that um, any issues are dealt with um, in, a, in a timely manner. Um, and I think for parents, um, I think that's p- important that uh, they understand and, and hear that um, from, from myself, from yourself, who sort of deal um, with pastoral issues on a, on a daily basis. Thank you. I think it's really important um, that we are able to share with you that actually the work that goes on behind the scenes, something that you may not see. Our students, and you will be aware of this, we are well above national average in terms of the grades that our students produce year on year. Um, And we don't need to advertise it because the students that leave here, the students that Mr. Dillon has just spoken about, our own children, they go on, they go on to fulfil Babaji's vision. They go on to help future generations. Empowering students with education. Education being the root out of poverty. That is what Sant Baba Amar Singh Ji's vision was when they set up the school and that's something that we wholeheartedly wish to fulfil when your children come to our school. But education doesn't just stop with academic excellence. 
education is about that whole ethos, that whole child that leaves here at the end of year 11 or end of year 13. And it starts with year 7. It starts with a great foundation into secondary school. It starts with that child feeling wanted, that child feeling safe, that child feeling that they can achieve every single aspiration that they may have. It's about aspiring, acquiring and achieving that knowledge in the classroom and then putting that into practice when they leave the classroom. It's about having those shared values, it's about having that respect, being able to carry out the seva in events that we put on, for example, Bargash. It's about in, in enabling themselves to do things that they never thought they'd be able to do. And the only way that they can do that is by coming here and seeing what a fantastic school, what a fantastic service that we do offer to them. We are really uh, excited to welcome them we're really looking forward to meeting you, parents, grandparents, children, and the future. Uh, Mrs Heath, thank you for that. Um, for parents that are coming in on Tuesday, what can they expect to see um, and what can their children expect to see? Very good question. So we open doors at 4.30 um, for all our external parents. Um, in terms of what's going to happen on the, on the day, we are going to invite you upstairs to our Gudvara, again, another advantage of attending our school. We do have Guru Granth Sahib Ji on site um, and we, we will have a small talk in the Gudvara followed by a tour by our own students of the school and it's really important sometimes that you do, you're able to speak to the students about what they think about our school. Um, and I think earlier Mr. D Mr. Sidhu um, would have spoken about our, our results um, but Mr. Dillon has also just spoken about students who go on to graduate at, at this school. They go on to, to universities, to apprenticeships, and only last week we celebrated that achievement with our current year 11s and uh, um, year 13s. And I think it's really important to celebrate success. So when you are coming around um, looking at the school, you will be celebrating success. Success of other current students, but also success of students that are joining us. Because we believe that every child comes with their own success and just builds upon that year on year. I think another real massive asset for our school is the extracurricular activities that we offer. Um, sometimes we look at sports as being the only extracurricular activity, but we're very lucky. We've got a massive technology department, Creative Technology. Um, they offer a number of different clubs across a number of different days. We also have a literacy coordinator who has recently um, been appointed, and she is working very closely with our English department, history departments, um, religious studies departments to ensure that we're able, able to offer those clubs such as journalism um, and clubs which really get students who are passionate about writing um, excited. I mean, and I think, um, you know, um, as, as uh, Mrs. Heed mentioned that we had a um, uh, celebration of uh, uh, year 11 and year 13 student, students who graduated and listening to some of them and one of the things that came out and I think which is a credit to the school um, is that the support, stru the support structure that's in place for our students um, I believe um, is second to none. Um, we staff, um, progress leaders, SLT uh, do go above and beyond in to make sure that uh, students are able to achieve um, the best possible outcome for themselves. Um, I think we all sort of acknowledge that school can be a difficult time, has been a difficult time, um, and it's important that when students start coming in at year seven, that we build those strong foundations, and those foundations includes building resilience and uh, making sure that students feel happy and confident. Um, and and that sort of works around our sort of share principles as well, where we're, where students. Um, and I'm sure that you'll be able to see this on uh, on Tuesday as well, where our students, not ask, not teachers asking them, but they they wanted to, they volunteered to offer their time up, um, they offered their seva to help, um, and that is one of the first sort of aspects of our shared values with the seva, with the you know the the selfless service to others, showing the humility, um, you know. The, the achievement and the respect and the equality, I believe, is all there for you to see and you will see on, uh, on, on, on Tuesday. Um, and you'll have the opportunity to speak to uh, members of staff um, who will potentially be teaching your children <coughs> in September. And it's a first opportunity to get to know 
um, some of our staff and you'll be able to see um, you know how how what a lovely opportunity it will be for your students to come to, to the school which has been within the community over the last 20-25 years um, a sort of beacon um, um, within uh, within the community would you agree with that Mrs Heed? Yes I think it's it's success sometimes can be measured in numbers I don't think success can be measured in numbers at Gunanak Sikh Academy in fact I believe that success year on year is growing um, and our students themselves can sh are, are proof um, of that success and, and so I've spoken about the alumni that leave come back and speak to our, our current students and explain you know the processes that they go through as young students at this school. Um, what sets us aside apart from other schools I think it's the nurturing elements that we do um, we do give up our time for these students they're not just students for us for us Good Nanak Sikh Academy is a family so we look after them, they look after us, and it's a really, really nice, positive environment to be in. Um, and I think you're, you're, once you come into the school, you feel part of that environment as soon as you come in. Please do feel free, um, if you have any questions, to call into school um, before the event if you need to. But it, we are open, like I say, on the 5th of October between 4.30 and 7pm. We really look forward to welcoming you then. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye